So let's take that opportunity to look at the actual tools themselves. So a standard slick line is basically just a solid strand of metal that's used with running out of the well. Digital slick line is different in that whilst it still uses the core standard slick line and retains all its mechanical strength, we've placed a coating on it. And that's what allows us to be able to use the telemetry over the wire. We've got three tools here. We've got the DPG, which is a pressure and temperature gauge. We've got the DIF, which is an inline flow meter. And then we've got the DCR, which is the digitally controlled release. The DPG means that whenever we do any run on digital slick line in the well, we can actually make that an intelligent run. So rather than just running a standard dummy drift run or a tag run, with this, we can already be collecting pressure data for the likes of something such as a gradient survey. With the temperature there as well, potentially if we had a leak in the tubing, etc., we'd be able to pick that up with this tool. The inline flow meter allows us to see the flow within the well as that flow moves past the turbine spinner that's mounted within here. This tool has been built so that it can be run with all the services and has indeed been run with perforating guns and P3 near well bore stimulation so that we can see if there's a change in the production profile immediately after firing either a P3 gun or a perforating gun. And finally, the DCR, the Digital Controlled Release, that tool eliminates the need to drop a drop cutter should we get into the situation where the tool string has become stuck in the well and we can't jar away from that situation. This is particularly important when it comes to activity on lightweight intervention vessels, where with a subsea lubricator, one could not drop a drop cutter if we were stuck and hence likely we'd have to cut the wire and move away for a further job maybe with the rig. With this tool now we can release on command, disconnect here and leave both an internal and an external fishing profile so we can go in with a more heavy duty fishing string if required. So this is the DJAR, which was developed uniquely for digital slick line services. This simplifies jarring significantly for the operator. It does that by allowing the operator to take an overpull with the jar armed at surface and then send a single command to the tool upon which it will release a collet here and the jar will fire. It really does make jarring operations much, much simpler. So this is the production flow meter caliper sonde, which is part of the production services platform. Within this tool, we have several key measurements, such as the full bore flow meter, the holder probes to measure the water within the well bore, an XY caliper, and a relative bearing to tell us where the probes are with respect to the high side of the well. So you're getting full quality production platform production logging data with no compromise despite the fact you're logging on a slick line. Most mechanical tools can be run on live digital slick line services as live act, but we can also run guns on live perf using the D-Trig slick line trigger with surface readout and control and also do live log which includes a pulse neutron tool a full production services platform and live bond which is the cement logging service